I still don't understand how my mic is so sensitive all of a sudden. It happens. I'm pretty- now, I'm convinced my car like is bitch. actually a fucking transformer. Okay, you're gonna have to- you're gonna have to explain yourself after that the, There's a- the, I'm, It's either my car is a fucking transformer, or there's like an actual fucking glitch in the matrix. So basically, for context, uh, my car, whenever I use the blinkers, I've always had to like manually flip them back off, because my car isn't all that new. It's a, it's, it's a 96, so I've always had to like manually flip my blinkers on and off whenever I turn. I was uh, driving around with it yesterday, and I noticed, just like, after I started making these turns, it was automatically flipping back, and it had never done that before. Oh no. I'm like, oh, I'm like okay, so either a fucking Transformer just fucking flew in and replaced my car, or there's like a glitch in the Matrix that's fucking happening, or there's some shit. So, are we talking leader class or masterpiece level Transformer? <laughs> yes. No fucking idea. <laughs> the cube in my chest, Solar. It's like, what the fuck? He just, like, fucking... What does cube? Fucking... <laughs> I don't have a fucking Rubik's Cube, guy. <laughs> he, just, he just gets freaked out and does, like, a tuck and roll outside of the car on the freeway. Oh, fuck no. It, my car's a Transformer? Yeah, no, I'm keeping that alliance. Shit. Dude, has there ever been cases where a Transformer transformed while a human was inside of it and the human just fucking died? Just I've seen, yeah. I've, I've seen, parodies. I've seen so many parodies of that. Yeah. Yeah. Mhm. Mm it's like I was thinking the other day, like if a human was inside when they transformed, they get fucking mangled. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they get fucking yeah, just <laughs> taken apart. <laughs> Ow, fucker. Just be a <laughs> bloody mess of of like. Unless they kept like the cab or like the just the passenger areas intact, which I'm pretty sure they don't. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You'd, you'd probably just end up, uh, just, just, uh, you'd, you'd make really nice ground beef. <laughs> Get turned into fucking mulch. <laughs> oh my Get turned god. Into fucking fertilizer. I could just imagine, like, Jesus. Optimus Prime accidentally doing I mean, like, a oh, dead body crap. can actually be used as fertilizer, as a matter of fact. Uh, decomposing material is very good for growing. Aw, uh, dude. <laughs> You're reminding me of that movie I saw with my boyfriend, uh, called Midsomar. <gasps> I've actually seen Midsummer. Yeah, it's uh, hey. it's, it's it's interesting. It's a I do love that movie, movie so much. Mainly you because it's a horror there. movie that takes place in broad fucking daylight. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and also, this horror in particular is actually based on the author's breakup. Oh wow! Is, it, is that true? Yeah. Oh. No. Um, the fucker decided. To basically, like, this is basically his vent piece, if you will, about his breakup with some person that he dated a while ago. Well, he made a really good fucking movie, so, you know, good Jesus. vent art, I guess. You've been burning them alive? Jesus Christ, holy fuck. What do, you mean <laughs> what do you mean based on their breakup? Did he fucking murder them afterwards? Oh, damn. No, it's just like... It's basically... I feel like what it is, it's basically just like an, an eternal, like anger and just grief and yeah. resentment i guess but yeah for a vent piece or like for a vent movie that's just brilliant in of itself <laughs> that just sounds like a bad breakup like like you Fuck. break up and then there's a lot of like fucking bad feelings afterwards and you're like well i don't have a therapist i know i'll make a fucking movie and get my feelings out that way I'll write a movie about it, yeah, where oh, they Mid horribly has kill some a whole trivia. bunch of other people. <laughs> I mean, if it makes you feel better, I would say that the vent was a success. Yeah. Like, you can either be Taylor Swift, where she based all of her music on breakup, or you can be the uh, the person that created Mid Somar and turn it into a horror. Damn it. Fuck off. Yeah, they call the fairy ring because as it turns out, mushrooms like decomposing material, so they'll oftentimes grow in dead bodies or around dead bodies. Ew. Also, also preservatives don't really... Yes. I mean, actually, yeah, I guess they would. Hey, Myth, I see you in the chat. Essentially, what I'm saying is that once you're dead, you're going to start decomposing regardless of how many preservatives and whatever that you do take. Yeah. It won't be as good... But it'll still absolutely be usable as fertilizer, unless like you're coated mm. with this stuff. Jeez. 
I'm trying to think. Cause I, I don't have oh, like I a, ram you. Get over here. Cause like oh. I don't have a green thumb or anything. I'm trying to think about she plant does. stuff. Yeah, Myth definitely does. <laughs> Why is Mega Man holding his chest like he's about to he's like he's having a health. Health. Ah no. damn it! He's hurting. And he died. Yeah. <laughs> What am I fighting up. for? Shut up, <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> I haven't even reached that part yet. I oh, know. Oh, I j a thought just occurred to me. That's not going to be until, like, the next playthrough when I do, uh, Zero. Yeah, exactly. We're not even doing Zero story this time. I, I think if I remember correctly, the reason why the voice acting was so bad was they didn't really get professional voice actors for it. They just got some people who actually spoke English who were living in Japan to dub it over. Uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah, no. I'm pretty sure they don't- they didn't ever get professional voice Damn acting it. for the X series. Yeah. Which is a shame. Then it hey. shows. Hey, can you guys check out my voice reel on Gumtree? You'll see that I can do, uh, characters from all different kinds of cartoons and- Oh shit, well, I got a job! <laughs> well, apparently, um, according to, oh, what was it, this YouTuber named C Dog, there are some um, voice actors that are famous today that were picked up in the streets and basically do one line or the other when it comes to voice acting in Japan. Hmm. So, the more you know, I guess. <laughs> wow, this dude, this dude. Wow, yep. yeah, no, <laughs> I think I think the spider web is definitely the go-to weapon for this guy. Yeah, that's why I went to this stage. Mm -hmm. Also, can Salt you charge this weapon wounds or not? Um, no, I have to get the uh, blaster upgrade. Yeah, I figured. This guy is a joke of an enemy. He's, he yeah, there's always a, one of those type of enemies. Out, yeah. As it turns out, yeah. It, the boss weapons in Mega Man will always have, at least in classic Mega Man, they'll always be very effective against one of the other bosses, so usually it's a matter of finding which one you should take on first, and then figuring out what uh, that weapon is effective, or who that weapon is effective against. Jesus Christ, Zuckerman. <laughs> so many shrooms. Sh Right, shrooms I was I was trying to think of a joke to do with shrooms with the boss, but I couldn't think of it. Don't worry. Um, this time the shroom saw God. We sent him there. Same uh -huh. day shipping. Same day shipping. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck no, have you have you ever yeah, you seen the tweet where the FedEx driver like kills somebody in a single fucking punch? <laughs> Wait, yeah, what? <laughs> yeah, no, there was, a, there was a FedEx driver, or like a UPS driver, I can't remember. It was some, like, fucking mail delivery, like, package delivery person. Fucking, they got into an altercation with somebody, it was like a street fight or something. They threw one punch, and apparently that ended up killing the guy. Ah, and one of the me. responses, and one of the responses to the tweet was, Damn, he sent him to God, same day shipping. <laughs> Jeez. Fucking one punch man in the face, ass! <laughs> what the fuck? Damn. I didn't, dude, I feel bad for laughing because somebody fucking died, but at the same time, that is a funny tweet. Oh my god. <laughs> same day shipping. Let me see if I can find it because it's a funny fucking tweet. Dude, fucking DM me that shit. Oh, I'll be laughing yeah. for days. I got an energy tank. Fuck yes. Hell yeah. Ah, so that's how people move with Dakimakras. Huh. What are you talking about? What? I was I was looking at Noah King's uh, recent tweet and apparently he ah, got a a U-Haul box for like um sport utility box and he's gonna keep his naked Dakimakra in that while moving. Oh my god. Once again, Blue Griffin and Dice are clipping the fucking stream. I appreciate it, guys. Because sometimes I take the clips and edit over them, so I appreciate ah, these clips. Damn it. Damn it. Here we go. <laughs> Let me see. A man, hurled, a, a man hurled racist slurs and a punch at a FedEx driver, then died after he was punched back. 
Damn, he sent him to God same day shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, once again, and we've said this many times, freedom of speech is not freedom of consequences. If you come popping off to somebody, you probably deserve to get punched in the face. Just saying. You you don't hey, have Robin, to fucking... What's up? Hey, hey, Robin, you don't have the jawline to handle that shit, okay? Just saying. Is that uh, jawlines? If you oh, we were talking about someone basically being punched in the face by a by some delivery person. And, and then they fucking died. You and don't died have to afterwards. to handle that kind of impact, okay? I'm just saying. Don't fucking be a dick to delivery drivers. I got a fucking delivery story. Like, I'm, I'm currently mad at the United States Postal Service because... I goofed on GameStop and got a game for five dollars that cost thirty bucks, uh, but it hasn't been fucking delivered yet in two goddamn weeks because it's stuck at one post office like three hours from me. But like, at least I'm not gonna be like, "Ah, oh, you're a dick" to the guy who's delivering shit. Don't be a dick. Wait, don't can't you just go dick. to the post office and just get it? No, they don't yeah. let you do that. I I asked them, I was like, "Hey, if I came three up, three hours out." Yeah, it's three hours out. It's six hours. I'm not driving Round six hours trip. for Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered on Switch, okay? Like, <laughs> that's the Assassin's game. Assassin's Creed on Switch. <laughs> yes. Uh, so, so a couple weeks ago, I follow Ow, a couple of, fucker. like, deal accounts for games because I was trying to get a PS5 and I've given up on that fact at this point. Um, yeah. and, but they, like, will tweet out, like, here's the GameStop deal of the day. And GameStop did a fucky when they were setting up their, like, uh, their sale. So they're putting Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered on sale. Now, normally the game runs for 30 bucks. They put it as a $23 off. So you only had to pay seven bucks. The problem is recently Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered had its MSRP lowered oh, to $19.99. So mm. I got the game for free because 23 off of $19.99 is $0. <laughs> okay. So I just, had to, I just had to pay the shipping for it. Very nice. Oh, so I got a game for pretty much for like five bucks. Uh, yeah, there's a somebody's Damn like it. Switch plus Assassin's uh. Creed. What? Yeah, there's a Assassin's Creed Three Remastered. It's on Switch, and I have a copy of that coming in at some point. I don't know when it's gonna show up. <laughs> okay, Robin, I have a proposal for you. Yes. Damn it. Uh, get rid of Assassin's Creed Three and get <laughs> Assassin's Creed Four. They don't have Assassin's Creed Four. Oh, not uh, for the Switch? Not on, I don't think it's on Switch yet. What the fuck? It should be if they put Let me three see. on the Switch. They'd be like, why? They won't pay the money for full price, make them pay in gas money and hold them at a post office three hours away. <laughs> to be fair, this post office is notoriously shit. They are very notorious for like holding packages for like three weeks. Oh, uh, yeah. So, like, I'm, I don't care because it was a $5 purchase. I would like the game before I go back to school, though. I mean, There's a couple yeah, things but at that the, are at the same in. time. You still what it was like five dollars. Yeah, it was a five dollar. It was a five dollar game. What game was it? Assassin's, Assassin's Creed Three Remastered. Oh, okay. Glad I didn't to hear see what... you were not paying attention at all. <laughs> I heard everything else. No, that's the thing. I I heard everything else that you were talking about except the name of the game that you bought. Oh, it is that she bought it's on times. Switch. It is on Switch, but I don't get it for free, so I'm not getting it. Well, Assassin's Creed 4 is way better than 3, so... Yeah. I've heard it's better than 3, so... Yeah. Maybe if, I, if I enjoy 3 enough... If I enjoy 3 enough, I might pick up 4 at some point. bitch likes to appear where I'm standing. It's so cheap. I hate those I'll kind of I'll put it bosses. to you like this. I'll put it to you like this. Assassin's Creed, alright? It's Assassin's, mm -hmm. but also with pirates. Oh, I know that it's a better game. But... But you, you can't really go wrong. <laughs> Listen, I did think about something. So I was thinking about video games uh, occasionally, and I just thought, hey, fire team fuck up, but we're pirates. Let's go buy Sea of Thieves. <laughs> oh, so, no, wait. You got to play Black Wake. Black Wake is a lot of fun, oh, too. Black Wake is actually a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. You should play Black Wake. I've never Wake. heard of that. I've okay, never heard so of Black it's Wake. A, it's, okay, so it's a game that's on Steam. Uh, it's actually... It's actually got a pretty decent following uh, now, but basically, you—it's it, naval combat, right? You, Hell it's yeah. like, it's like really old school naval combat. So everybody's got like revolvers and muskets and fucking, you know, cutlasses and shit like that. 
Yep. Yeah, and uh, whenever you whenever you pilot a ship, it's not just okay. I'm in this ship. I have control of the guns. You actually have crew, and all the crew are other members of your team. So you can you essentially role play as a pirate while you're on the ship, and you're giving them commands. So you'll say, "All right, right side load there cannons we go. or some shit like that." There, I outsmarted you you'll... now, motherfucker. And it's actually very, it's actually a lot of fun because there's a lot of, it's kind of like Guns of Icarus, really. Yeah. Guns of Icarus, but you, instead of being in an airship, you're, you're on an actual sea ship. It's a lot of fun just getting everybody to work together to, like, light, to load these cannons and shit. And you'll see all kinds of crazy fucking people that are sitting, like, I remember one time I just got absolutely piss-wasted. <laughs> And I just started <laughs> shouting at other people like a fucking pirate, and then we ended up in, we ended up getting like the most kills that game. We sunk like nice. every ship that came our way. Oh hey, golden, golden. Yes. Very nice. nice. <laughs> you can hear that one. By the way, you oh, it got on my pop filter. Oh no! Ah! <laughs> oh. By and also, way, Black Wake is. Can you guys see the uh the game? Yeah, yeah, I can, yeah. Yes, yeah. Okay. What, is, what upgrade did you get from uh, Harvey Birdman over there? It was aiming laser or something like that? Laser sight? Okay. Uh, but guess what I'm drinking? What? Uh, what? Is it Mountain This Blair? stream is sponsored by Mountain Dew Major Melon, everybody. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Jesus! Holy shit. Jesus. Y'all I fucking knew it! Go. I knew it! I had True. this weird Galaxy feeling! Galaxy. Galaxy? Oh my god. <laughs> Your fucking Holy shit. You're fucking still. Sorry. You, you're oh, you're a fucking gremlin. Jesus That Christ. was fucking. That was funny though. Holy shit. Galaxy. Somebody please clip that. Clip that, that one screen, for me. That screen killed me. <laughs> oh, god, shit. I killed Golden, yay! Yay! <laughs> We're gonna go down to the golden rocks that we're doing that. Oh. oh my god, you got out of it, buddy. You gotta, you gotta work on your timing. Oh, no. also, if you're interested in getting Black Wake, it's only a buck on Steam. Oh, it's only a um, buck. Fuck yeah. It's only a buck. Ah, yeah, what, game? Right. what game, Riley? Black Wake. Black Wake. Black Wake. Uh, I need to look that one up. I'll add that to my list. <laughs> I, I was screaming because coincidentally I watched the fucking Super Bowl podcast like just about earlier so I was just like I I was like in the back of my mind I was just like hey uh wait is she gonna say Mountain Dew Water and what Mountain Dew Water and she said it and I was like yeah I knew it <laughs> yeah, we Jesus. set up the first time when you fucking the broke funniest everybody's thing. speakers. The funniest thing <laughs> is that you were like, oh, I was watching that podcast. I'm like, yeah, you were on that podcast. Yeah. <laughs> and I marathoned it because I have nothing better to do. <laughs> the thing I remember the most on that podcast is both Robin and I agreeing together on that goddamn sat uh, Squatch uh, TV ad. Fuck that guy. I still get him. I still get him in my fucking, in my ads. I'm like, I don't care. One of these days I'm gonna fucking buy the soap, just so we can all stop. <laughs> like, I will spend $30 on fucking soap if I never have to hear that man again. <laughs> That's the only reason why I... anybody would want, like, want to buy Squatch. Just like, okay, I'll fucking buy it, just stop appearing like, on my pre-roll ads. <laughs> From what I've heard, like, it's good soap. Like, it's actually pretty decent. I think it's a little bit overpriced, but, you know, fuck if I know. I just mm -hmm. wanted to stop. <laughs> Holy Christ, it's raining now. It's raining, man. Man. Well, Hallelujah. Hallelujah, it's, it's raining, raining, man. It's raining, man. man. It's raining, man. man. Good job, everyone. <laughs> Good job, all of us. You know what's funny? Uh, now, just You know what's funny about this game? Is that... What? So... It's a thing that happens in these games where if X is in lava, it doesn't kill them immediately, but spike pits will. Absolutely. As we all know, spikes are more dangerous than lava. Yeah, I, clearly. I don't... Didn't you know that? No, didn't you know? lava's lava. Yeah, didn't, you... Did, Listen, didn't you know that? 
Listen, it's it. Listen, you know, like lava, it's very, very hot, but spikes, pointy, real sharp, real, spikes? real painful. See, spiked pits were banned by the Geneva Convention, whereas lava pits are still not. So spike is more oh, dangerous shit. than lava is. Hey, see, spike pits banned by the Geneva Convention, and very clearly lava still exists. So yeah, lava I mean, pits are perfectly fine. So lava, ergo, lava exists. Lava less dangerous than sp than spike. Lava less dangerous than spit. <laughs> than spit. <laughs> I can't fucking. I mean, lava can't. Lava can't insult you like spitting on someone can. So like maybe. <laughs> so if somebody spit on Mega Man, would like would like that give him more damage Damn than a spike it. pit? Oh, he ah. got you with the sure you can. Sure you can. <laughs> sure you can. I almost had him. Fuck. Well, get in there and try again. Let's go. go in again. You got this, bitch. You just gonna I let him? You just gonna let him shore you can you into oblivion? Fuck no! We're not sitting. We're not taking we that go. spin down. The black quick one dollar experience. We're I like that I just said. You've no, got this bitch, and it could be you've got this okay. comma bitch, or you've got this bitch, as in the boss is a bitch. Mm. Is Golden the bitch, or is the boss a bitch? We'll never know. The boss is a bitch. The boss is definitely a bitch, but he just got a lucky shot in, and Golden was unfortunate. That's what happened. No, the boss is a bitch. Golden Fox is the bitch. <laughs> He's the Wait, bad are they bitch. both bitches? Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's your that's for the audience to decide. Hang on, what's up there? 